just beat him. Stand here with a bull whip. Say, here, you take that thing apart. You stupid son of a All right, happy Monday, guys. You see that right there? Six injectors. Whole box full of quill tubes, nuts, tubes, lines, all that fun shit. Get this old girl put back together. Maybe we get a run in the day. I don't know. We'll see how the old back and body feels after the weekend. Have a good day, boys. Fly, Greta, fly. Wow. Special appearance by Uncle Josh today, boys. Alright, so I can't be the only one this happens to, so this is like the second or third time when I've done injectors on C93s that I've managed to damage something. And if you guys look right there, that's the old sensor group right there is your part number. Uh, that's the manifold absolute pressure sensor. That, for some reason, it's right there, mounted right next to cylinder one, and when you're taking the line off, you're taking the quill tube off, guess what? She decides to want to fucking snap. So that's my luck every time I do one. I always crack them or break them completely, uh, mostly because I just go full retard on them. So have a great day. Hopefully, y'all learned something there. I'm kind of retarded. Shake hands with danger. All right, so contrary to popular belief, if you have a massive boost leak, especially something like this out of the air to air, um, she's not going to burn. All right, let's just take a minute here and just why does cat do this shit? So you got a pulley right here, idler, and then you've got this fucking cap right here. So factory, the caps come on there. Well, when the bearing goes bad or whatever in the idler, what ends up happening? Well, you got to take that fucking cap off. You can't get the cap. There's no part number for the fucking cap anyway, but it's just like you're doing too much. Did you, did you need to go that, all that strife and issues to fucking beautify a fucking idler pulley? I mean, come on. Gah. Have a good day, boys. Well, look where we're at, boys. Awful lot of yellow junk out here. Well, look at that little dude. Look at him. Shake hands with danger. You guys ever have those days where you've had to take three non-truck routes to get to a job site? and deal with a bunch of broken English just to find out that they didn't do what they said they did and then they did it in front of you and then the machine's fine. So you wasted like an hour, two hours to get to a job site just to cycle the key and hook up to it, pull a PSR. It's kind of the day I'm having so far. It's been a great day. You guys have a great day. See you in the next one. Shake hands with danger.